Yeah. She drop it low. She drop it low. She put my coat. She put my coat. She talking to me. What's up guys, your girl Gabby, and today I am back with the first video of the new year, and first video of 2023. I am doing a Christmas haul, a what I got for Christmas video, and I know that it's 2023 already, and you're like, girl, we don't care about what you got last year. But for those of you who do, I think you're gonna like this haul. I was really blessed this year, and I got a lot of gifts I wasn't expecting, and I just, you're gonna like it. So let's just hop right into it. So the first item I want to show you guys is this Steve Madden bag that I ended up getting from my sister and her boyfriend. And they really did what they needed to do with this bag because it's Steve. Like, who doesn't love Steve? And it's kind of giving, like, um, luxury bag, okay? I don't have any luxury bags. And that sounded sadder than it needed to. But I don't have any luxury bags, but this one, let's look inside together. So there's a little coin purse attached. There is, I never knew this was in here. What, like a bag in a bag? Um, I don't know what I'll put in here, but I love it. I have no clue how much they paid for it because it's kind of rude to ask, like, hey, <laughs> next friend gift, but how much was it? But I believe that that was bought at Burlington and I remember seeing a bunch of Steve Madden kind of bags um, and other designer bags there, so you guys can shop there. So I wanted to make sure that I showed you guys these shoes that I got. Uh, our family likes to do wish lists nowadays and I literally do like a full document workup where I put what I want and I put like pictures next to it so that there's like visual aids, you know, um, and send it out to my like immediate family so that they get an idea of what I want for Christmas. Somebody said it sucks the fun out of Christmas, but I think they still had fun shopping. So. And I, oh, but yeah, I wanted some thigh high or like knee high stiletto heel boots. And um, my mom delivered. She bought me these suede stiletto heel boots, and they are thick calf friendly. Which that's my that was that's always my main concern whenever I get boots. That's why I haven't been able to find any. But these have a zipper that goes all the way. It looks like to the ankle, um, which is it's helpful. I believe these were from Amazon, but we'll see. The, We'll see you like later. So I got these lights because I've been complaining about lights for months and my mom was tired about hearing, my mom was tired of hearing about hearing, do I know English? My mom was really tired of hearing me talk about lights um, and here we go. So she bought me a two pack of lights and I haven't tested them out yet because I have been waiting and they'll probably get tested out on my TikTok. Yeah, oh, let's go through all the colors real quick. There's six different RGB colors. You can do red, green, blue, yellow, violet, and cyan, whatever cyan is. And then three white light modes, I already told you guys. And then there's a transition, a tricycle, and a blink, and a multi. They also have adjustable heads, which is really cool and comes in handy. And I will definitely keep you guys in the loop about how well or not well these work. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure these are from Walmart. Again, I will be linking all the stuff below. So you guys, when I told you that my mom went light crazy, um, she, she went light crazy crazy, like light stupid, light silly. She bought me a 10 inch ring light to go along with my other lights, my two pack of lights. So this is bringing the light count to three lights, okay? Again, I haven't opened it because I wanted to just show you guys, you know, you guys come first. So. This one has three colors, lightning, three color lightning modes, 10 adjustable, wow, 10 adjustable brightnesses, and a thrix, thrixy, a 360 degree adjustable head so you can turn the ring light any way you want, USB power supply, and then it says it's convenient to carry. So also, not only is this a ring light, but it has a phone holder. Normally I have my ring light and then I have my tripod right next to it. This is a two-in-one, okay? Making it easier, more efficient, I love that. It also has a selfie remote control, which definitely comes in handy, and yeah. This brings our light count to um, four, because my mom went, like I said, she went crazy, silly, stupid, dumb on the lights. Tired of hearing me, she's just annoyed at this point. So she bought me a desk lamp light. It says it's for vlogging, it says it's two-in-one, has an adjustable mount and LED lights and a flexible neck. 
So this is super cool for, probably for like TikToks more so. This is definitely coming in handy. I asked for like a bedside tray and like I really don't need like a bedside tray but like it looked cool like I saw somebody else with it on YouTube and you know how that goes. So I asked for a bedside tray and it's literally a tray that you put on the side of your bed. It has a cup holder. First of all, it has a cup holder. Like we've already won here. I don't know if it's stable enough to put the laptop on and I don't know if I want to test it with the cup holder next to it. Yeah, we're gonna have to play with that a little bit. Another gift that I got for Christmas is something I've already put on my TikTok. I ended up getting some Cory Kenshin merch for my boyfriend and I. I bought us both some hoodies and I ended up buying a top as well. I feel like I'm hopping on the bandwagon, honestly, because I didn't know who Corey Kenshin was a few years ago until my boyfriend introduced me to him, and now we watch Blue Scary Sunday together, but comment down below if you know who Corey Kenshin is so I don't sound crazy. But yeah, he's an awesome YouTuber. We wanted to support him, and we wanted to match. Like, what couple doesn't want to match? They get a few makeup products. I asked for some on my wish list, but I've been asking for makeup for a few years now, and my sister's the actual like person in the family who does makeup really well. It's what she wants to do in life. She wants to be like a makeup artist and stuff. So when I ask her makeup and she gives me makeup and I don't do anything with it, she's like, girl, you really don't want to use the makeup, do you? Like, and she's right. It's been a few years, you know? Uh, every year I ask for some sort of makeup, some palette, something. And with the intention to start in my makeup journey. Anyway, I asked for this eyebrow gel, this Morphe eyebrow gel, this clear Morphe supreme eyebrow gel and I haven't gotten a chance to use it yet but I am excited because it's supposed to be a sculpting and shaping wax so it's literally like a clear gel you just put on your eyebrows and you can probably just like walk out the door you know something like that and then and then I also got a putty bronzer yeah um I don't know what to do with this but it is an elf putty bronzer and it's in the shade golden days i got some books which this is problematic because like i've been having the same vision board goals for a minute and last year i wanted to read 12 books and um yes how many i read um yeah i read like 24 pages of one book <gasps> so this year i thought maybe if i chose fiction instead of trying to read all these self-help books maybe that would motivate me to read a little bit more because i used to actually be like a heavy reader back in um like up until like middle school maybe one of the youtubers that i like to watch her name is just jordan and she recommended truly devious and it's supposed to be like a mystery series and it kind of intrigued me a little bit so i got the first and second book of the series uh, I'll probably have to get the third book later because they didn't have it apparently when my mom went to order. Um, but I believe these were on Amazon. I'll have to double check. I got a lot of self-care stuff and that's never a bad thing, okay? This was from my boyfriend. He got me this Dr. Teal's little gift set. And Dr. Teal's has always been like a go-to brand. I have some of the stuff underneath my sink right now. And that stuff really does smell really good and it does actually like relax you. I also got a four-piece Betsy Johnson set. It's supposed to have body wash, body lotion, body scrub, and body butter. That's what it's supposed to look like. I believe this was from Ross and I know like Ross and Burlington normally carry a lot of like Betsy Johnson stuff. So, the, ooh, that was my mother. <laughs> I also got some shower streamers, which I haven't used, so I can't tell you guys yet how they work or what I think of them, but these are supposed to have menthol and eucalyptus, lavender field, rose garden, virgin fortis, fortis? forest, cypress, sage, and patchouli, and lemongrass tea. And they're supposed to be a set of 12 pieces. I believe you just put them in the shower and let the shower run and it's supposed to like smell like that scent. I believe that my mom got on maybe Amazon? I also got a cute little gift set that is vitamin E and shea butter and it comes in a cute little sequin bag. I'm not really sure where I got this from. I believe the scent is white jasmine and I already know it's probably gonna smell really good. I just like the way it's wrapped. It's a body scrub, a shower gel, a bath salt, 
a bubble bath, and a body lotion. This is also like a soap. There's like a soap in here that's in the shape of a rose. So I also got these smoothing hand masks and smoothing foot masks. They are supposed to be like spa hand and foot masks. One has coconut butter, honey, and almond oil, and the other one had almond nut. Did I just say almond nut oil? One has coconut butter, co one has cocoa butter, honey, and almond oil, and the other one has cocoa butter, sika, and peppermint oil. I haven't used them yet, obviously. Like I said, you guys come first. You guys get the first look, the first unwrap, first unbox, all of that. I also got some some perfume. Um, it is Caroline Herrera. <laughs> It's Caroline Herrera's Good Girl, and it's actually a dupe. I don't know what the actual one smells like, so it's not like I can compare or anything. I'm just going to show you guys what the dupe looks like. Yeah. Okay, so so this I'm very grateful for this. Um, this is what I asked for. I asked for some new perfume to expand my collection. Um, I think I'll just do a side by side of what the original one and what the dupe looks like, and I'm just gonna leave it that. So another cute gift that I got, and it was actually on my Christmas list, were these Apple Watch bands. And so I got one in silver, one in black, and I believe one in gold. I haven't tried them out yet, but I've been excited to switch them out because, you know, the band that I currently have doesn't always go with everything. This is like, you're going somewhere, okay? You're going somewhere, but you want your watch with you. And you need to make it, you need to bring the bougie with you okay the luxury with you. the luxury on a budget with you and you make a switch a little swatch and no one will ever know i believe this gift was from amazon but again i'll be linking everything another cool gift that i got this year are these airpods and they're just kind of here to replace my old ones but i definitely appreciate that um these are gifts from my sister i i need these airpods i lost my uh airpods sadly around my birthday in august uh I went to Chili's and came back without them, and uh, I've been suffering with regular earphones since then. And you guys know how much a struggle it is to like work out or like dance or like move around with like the earbuds in your head and like the cord, you know? Maybe I sound really bougie for saying that, but wireless just makes it a lot easier. My best friend ended up giving me a Christmas gift too and she gave me these hot and cold gel eye masks which are reusable which is super cool. Maybe I'll have to do like a self-care video on my channel because I have so many self-care products that I need to make sure that I use and if they work well I want to be able to put you guys on. She also got me, I wasn't expecting her to give me two gifts, like I can give her two gifts. She also got me this Virgo book because you guys know I am a Virgo and it's in my favorite color so it's basically a book about Virgos and a book to help me know more about my sign it says like get to know Virgo the Virgo deep dive give me more so like food and cooking how Virgos handle money how Virgo handles the boss Virgo characteristics physical Virgo how Virgo communicates like that is such a cool gift i just know that i'm a virgo that's pretty much it i know like four mm, maybe three characteristics and that's it <laughs> this is the book okay thank you bestie okay i'm almost done i i know i feel like i got a lot of stuff so some more self-care stuff that i ended up getting from my sister's boyfriend's mom was this candle this is from bath and body works it smells really sweet like if you're into that kind of sugary kind of scent oh it smells good it is the scent sugared snickerdoodle so y'all know what snickerdoodle smell like it smells sweet i also got a bath bomb some shea butter hand cream and some hand sanitizer in the same scent. 
So I'm just gonna smell like a snickerdoodle all year. Scrumptious, delicious, and yummy. But yeah, all those things are from Bath and Body Works. Um, you know how they do the little sales all the time, so you can probably still find those. Um, maybe it's seasonal, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I like Spongebob a lot, and I bought myself this beanie. I wouldn't say for Christmas necessarily, but I was just gonna show you guys. And it's kind of funny because I act like I actually wear beanies, but a lot of the time my hairstyle doesn't allow it or it looks too bulky or it makes my head look too big, so I don't do that. But um, I still have my like natural hair out, so there'll be a few opportunities to wear like a wig and also put this beanie on. So you guys might still catch me in it. I got this from Ross, it was $8 worth it my mom went ahead and bought me a bunch of spongebob socks i believe this is a six pack of socks of spongebob socks with di different characters on them which i love i can't even lie i love if you ever want to give me a gift socks is the way to go no shame in saying that i ended up buying this for myself as well and um this was before somebody bought socks for me so these are odd socks they are from ross it's a five pair pack of socks crew length socks i got these led lights that my boyfriend got me um i'm gonna probably be putting these up to make like a cool little vibey youtube setup situation there will be a video on that soon my mom got me this fanny pack and it is really cute i cannot tell a lie i cannot tell a lie i just love fanny packs and purses it comes with a cute little, I believe this is on the shoulder, I just can't figure out how to put it together, but it, it's like a little, little coin purse. Like you guys have seen those Prada or like the Prada dupes and stuff like that. Like this is a version of that. This is gonna be so cute wherever I decide to wear or wherever I decide to wear it with. All right guys, so that was the end of my what I got for Christmas video slash Christmas haul video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just wanted to casually kind of show you guys what I got and not be like, too, not make it like too crazy, you know? I just was blessed to receive a lot of items and I just wanted to show you guys. Like I just, I felt like you guys would like these items too. And that's why I linked everything as the best, as best as I could, okay? You know, sometimes I can't be asking people, where did you get this, can I get the link? Because it just sounds like rude, like girl, just take the gift. This year is going to be so good. Like, I am looking forward to posting, uploading, and making better quality content and just investing more in my craft and listening to you guys and putting out videos that you guys like and I like and us just building this community in general. So, thank you guys so much for watching and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. See you guys next week. Bye! My hope is that I can just keep the camera running and that's how quick this video will be, but you know how long I talk, so <laughs> future editing guys, good luck. <laughs> I don't think there's anything oop. Am I okay? <laughs> Bam. Wait. Bam. This is so cringe, oh my gosh. Maybe I should just like restart. If I haven't said it enough times, I will be linking everything down in the description box. Why did I still have my hands out? I don't know. Christmas this year was a huge success and I was truly blessed. Bars. I couldn't help myself. I'm sorry. 